The following is being presented by EA Game Changers. Hi guys, Samantha here and welcome back to my channel and finally a look at Sims 4 Island Living. And before we get started, I just want to remind you guys that this is being presented by EA Game Changers. They did give me a download code in order to do a video for you guys to kind of show you all of the goodness that comes with this brand new expansion pack. So I will admit um, I'm a little bit behind doing some videos because I was out of town and then I went back out of town, but I am here now. The game actually did come out. I'm sorry. The pack became available to download actually today but if you're still on the fence about whether to purchase it or you still want to know like uh you know what's in it or what's not in it or just what have you you know you can still sit back and watch the video and just gotta kind of get a feel for what the whole pack is about so i will break this up probably into a couple parts i have a handful of things i would like to do but the first part this part will just be created sim items we'll take a look at the clothing the hair i know they're supposed to be like so much awesome hair and um you know all of the good stuff and hopefully we'll get stuff for pets and the kids and etc and we'll take a look at all that stuff too so we already have it downloaded and it says welcome to sims 4 island living welcome to solani I might be butchering this. So normally when we have new packs and stuff come out, I try to stay away from other videos, other streams. The most I've seen is the screenshots that I've come, I came across on Twitter. So I'm um, just giving you guys a heads up. If I do butcher the name, you know, I apologize in advance because like I said, I haven't seen anything on it, but I do like to kind of see things for the first time on my own. So that way I can kind of have like my first reaction and it's more genuine it's more true because this really is a reaction because i haven't seen anything on it whatsoever besides screenshots so i don't know if it's sulani or solana or celine anyway welcome to this island here we go set sail <laughs> set sail on the glistening water in your island canoe swim to your heart's content and explore the scenery on a watercraft build a spectacular sandcastle catch some rays and even meet a mermaid we can pitch in or help become a conservant, con, ooh, conservationist. What was I trying to say? And watch your Sims impact bloom all over the island. Take to the waves for fishing or diving. Become a lifeguard to keep the locals safe under the sun. Sims can do a few odd jobs or fish for their next meal. Uh, then we have engage in local culture. You can tradition runs deep on this island and your Sims get to experience. Immerse it Sims in their newfound lifestyle by attending a pit barbecue event, learning about local folklore, tracing, tasting tropical delicacies and chatting with elementals from the island. And then of course you can dress your Sims in the tropical garb inspired by the sun, sand and waves or gear up for water activities like snorkeling, swimming and decorate a, a rustic oasis with home objects and unwind at the tiki bar. I'm definitely looking forward to some of the build by mode objects because some things i have been wanting for a while it looks like we're going to get in this pack and definitely lounge chairs uh reclining just more outdoor stuff and i've been wanting a beach since before we got tropical um not tropical before we got um jungle adventures but anyway long story short these are some of the screenshots but we're about to get in the game right now it looks absolutely amazing i've been hearing mixed things though i hear people some people are saying that it's awesome and some people are saying it's not what they thought it was going to be but either way let's go check out the cast items first and oh okay zaddy okay i bet you when i take off his glasses though he's not going to be cute i'm sure he's not but anyway <laughs> Okay, guys, let's take a look at the male cast items first. So I'm looking at the aspirations. It looks like we got a new one for location, which is going to be um, beach life. The Sim wants to take it slow and enjoy beach life. Did we get any new traits? Let's see real quick. Does Oh, child of the islands. These Sims experience a spiritual connection to the islands, honor the islands by partaking in their culture, summon powerful elementals and reap the rewards of their blessings or the consequences of their disfavor. What? All right. So we got that one. And then we got child of the ocean. Answer the call. Oh, wait, do it again. I missed it. Do it again. Okay. Oh, cool. Okay, cool. And then we got child of the ocean. Answer the call of the ocean. Sims with this trait will prefer water related activities and feel closer to denizens of the sea. Nice. Okay. I like some of the new animations. That's actually pretty cool. Oh, oh no, I wanted to see you from the side. Can you, can you do it? Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right. Uh, let's see what else we got. I think 
that is it. All right, so we'll just make them good just for the sake of doing something. We did get this in a new update where you can randomize traits, which is awesome. I think we've been kind of like doing that on our own because there's like websites and stuff where you can randomize Sims traits. I want to even say at one point it was a, a mobile app that you can do it. Either way, I'm glad that they finally included it in the actual creative sim items. But anyway, so let's go check out here. Styles first. I'm actually going to take off his glasses. Okay. Oh, he's not too bad. I was, I was, I was worried. Sometimes when they put glasses on, it's like you have a disaster behind those lenses. But anyway, um, we didn't get any new skin. Doesn't look like, looks like everything is the same. Did we get any new? Let's just double check. We didn't get any new skin details because now that we have a new, um, a cult, which is the mermaid, is this something new? Ooh. Is this new teeth? Who, 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 who does these teeth belong to? I'm confused. Just slightly confused. Who do these teeth belong to? Okay. Yeah, y'all, these are new teeth. But why? So, dude, when you smile, that's what I'm going to be... I don't even understand. What, what, what creature has these teeth? I'm just, I'm curious about that. I... I don't understand the teeth situation. Okay. <laughs> Brow scars. Let's see. Teeth scars, eye scars, and mouth scars. Nothing on there, but we did get a new set of teeth, but I'm not 100% sure. I don't know if these are supposed to be mermaid teeth. Do mermaid have jagged pointy teeth? I'm not sure. Okay. We won't be messing with the teeth, but anyway, let's take a look at the hair. So we got this new hairstyle, which is, ooh, it's like a mohawk. It's a very shaggy looking mohawk. Uh, then we have this updo, curly updo. Nice. Okay, let's hope we got this in the ladies here too, because I would like this for both. That is really nice. All right, and then we got this. Wow. Y'all, they have been doing curly hairs really good lately. Like, I have been digging the curly hairs. They have been doing really good. Yeah, they've definitely been doing curly hairs really, really good. Actually, like, it's, it's, it's very thick. It's very wide has like this extra little oomph right here, this extra little bang piece right here. The only thing that's gonna bother me about this hairstyle is when I think about the, the wind, I mean the beach, I think about something wind, kind of windswept, just kind of like blowy, and this looks kind of stiff to me. Um, and it's not really sitting really well on his shoulders, but I'm not gonna be super picky about it. But it's a really nice hairstyle nonetheless. Uh, but yes, yeah, it's a little bit like this little gap right here. I know it's going to bother me. I probably won't ever use it for the guys. Maybe for the ladies, but maybe for the ladies. That right there is probably going to bother me just a smidge. Um, which maybe they wanted to make it like that so it wouldn't go into... Oh no, it goes with their... Okay, I was like, maybe so it won't go into their bodies. But that clearly did nothing. Okay, it just moved with it. So it's like he almost has this invisible barrier in between him and the hair. I'm not going to be picky, y'all. Y'all know I can get picky. I'm not going to get picky. All right. So then we have this hairstyle here with the uh, flower wreath. And I can almost, oh, it's the same color. And, oh, no, it changes colors. Okay. I was going to say I can almost guarantee that it's going to be this different colors with each hairstyle. But no, it does change a little bit. Some of them are the same color. So I wish that they would give us this as an accessory. I love the hairstyle, like minus the flowers. I mean, I like the flowers, but I would like to have the option minus the flowers. Um, so this would have been nicer had this been like a hat accessory. And then we could have just had this hairstyle, which is really pretty. Cause I can imagine it's kind of got like a probably a center part or yeah, like an off centered part, but still it's very full and frames the face. But what if I don't want the flowers? So I don't know, that's kind of limited. So. Huh, I would have much rather this as a hat, to be honest with you guys. So that way I could have the choice and then I could also choose the color. Because the only thing I hate about getting these preset hairstyles with accessories is that now I feel like if I give her like a certain hair color, like let's say I do this brown, and if I want, I'm saying her or him or her, whoever, to match the flower, like if I want everything to be matchy or coordinated, I'm going to be limited to what I can put on the sim. You know what I'm saying? So... Anyway, yeah, okay, so this is the other hairstyle, which is really nice. Again, they have been blowing my mind lately with the textures. It's so funny. It just feels like they l literally have been listening to the um, to the players. Like, you guys got kind of lazy with the hairs, and they have been definitely stepping up the game with the hairs. This looks really nice. Um, let's see how it looks in other color. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, very nice, because you can see, like, the little ringlets and everything. They did a really good job. Okay, so the hair so far, eh. I probably will definitely use this one. Honestly, I probably won't use... 
I do like this one. I probably would use that one for the guys. And I probably would use this as a, an alternative to this. Like his hair is down, then his hair goes up. I probably won't use this. And I probably... The funny thing is, I like this one from here. Like, <laughs> but the back of this would probably drive me nuts. And it looks like there's a little glitch back here. Yeah, there's like a little... I don't know if it's the... Let me see. Let's back out a little bit. Yeah, no, it's a little bit of something right there that kind of didn't go over well. I'm being picky, y'all. I'm being picky. I'm being picky. I'm being picky. So let's just move on. <laughs> did we get... Hold on before we move on. Okay. <laughs> did we get any new facial hair? No. Uh, we did get a couple new hats. We have this uh, tie-up hat right here, which is really nice. Comes in these different swatches. Nice. And then we have like a snorkel gear. Is this like snorkeling? Okay. I think. Um... It doesn't look like snorkeling though. It looks like a gas mask. Like you're about to go into, you know, I don't snorkel. So I'm saying that and that could be snorkel gear or scuba. It'd be scuba diving gear. Yeah. And that could be scuba. I don't scuba, but I snorkel, which is just like the little tube that you stick out the water, but nothing like a full mask like this. But um, it kind of looks like a gas mask, but it's cool. It's cool nonetheless. Um, so I'm a little bit perturbed. This is Island Living. I was imagining like beach hats and different little types of other hats, but maybe for the ladies we got that, which we'll see in a second. But for the guys, this is all we got. So accessories, we got, okay, so here go the snorkel goggles. All right, and it comes in different colors. Then we have a lay here, which is really nice. Ooh, they did really good with the textures on here. Oh, the colors are beautiful. Okay, cool, I like this. And then of course we got, let's take this off, a whistle. So, because you know, they have the lifeguard thing now. So that's kind of cool. So you have an accessory whistle here. Very nice. Kind of flat, but it's nice nonetheless. All right. So we got that. All righty. And then for makeup, of course, we got the makeup that's supposed to be for the merman, I'm imagining. And then we have this one too, the scales. It looks like you can layer them both. Maybe one is considered eyeliner and one is considered face paint. Okay. So you can layer them up and have different colors and stuff. That's actually pretty cool. Ooh, I can't wait to try that, y'all. Which, speaking of which, I guess in order to make different occults, let's see, it would be add an occult sound, and then we got mer. Okay, so merman. Okay, so let's see if there's anything different we get for the mer. <gasps> Whoa! Oh wow! Oh, that's awesome. Will he have? Okay, okay. Let's do him. Let's just do him for the sake. Okay, so we have his. Sim to mer. Okay, so this will be Sim, and then that's his mermaid form. Okay, and then this is Link mermaid form with Sim form. Okay, I'm not even sure what that means. Okay, so this is his mermaid. So let's take a look at that stuff real quick. So if you do a merman, um, oh, we need to look at tattoos by the way too, because there are some new tattoos. I did see that. So we got this one here, and then we have this back one here. You can kind of layer those up. And that looks like that's all we have for the tattoos. Uh, all right. So let's see. Do we have any new tops? So, oh, wait, you know what? Before we go over to this, y'all, let's take a look at the tails real quick. I don't want to. I'm jumping ahead already. But these are the tail options. And it looks like they're based on type. Like maybe this is like a very simple one and you get different colors. Wow. These are really pretty. And then here is the... What's the difference though? Is the tail a little bit different? No, the tail is the same. Yeah, I'm trying to figure out why they gave us two different categories. Like they were different types of tails. Like this one definitely has a little bit more pizzazz at the bottom and on the sides. But these two look exactly the same. They're just different swatches. Swatch options maybe? Okay, then we have these two are exactly the same too. It's just different swatch options. Okay interesting all right okay okay well let's let's go back to uh the regular over here before we before we get ahead of ourselves so let's take a look at the tops we have oh well there are different tops then okay because i was thinking it'd be the same stuff for the guys let's make sure that there's not any more tattoos that i'm missing because maybe there's tattoos for mermaids and then there's tattoos okay so there are different ones here because we have the body one then we have a leg one of course, they wouldn't have the leg for the guys because they have the fins, so that makes sense. And then there's a leg over here as well. Wow. Then we have this back one. Okay, bunch of tattoos. Very nice. I like these. They look like tribal tattoos. I see, oh, I was about to say, is this the bunny, the freezer bunny? I was thinking maybe it was. 
that's actually pretty cool. Okay, so let's take a look at the tops because I can already tell this video is going to be super long probably. So we have this one here, which is like one of those swim tops uh, when you get in the water and you want to have your body completely covered so you won't get sunburned, which of course we have the sunburn thing now, but I think it's only going to be, if I remember correctly reading on Twitter, it's only going to be for the island so it won't cross over to the other worlds, which I'm kind of okay with that. I know some people are kind of like, oh, that's a bummer. But truth be told, like the index, the heat index is different in different regions of the country or of the world in general. So, you know, where you could be in the sun here, it might be a different, like especially in Anchorage, <laughs> it might be different as if you're in the sun in Hawaii. You know what I'm saying? Like the exposure might be different. Elevations make a difference. Um, the humidity, the heat index, all that stuff makes a difference. So I was kind of like, yeah, I can see it being like it only affects you at the beach because maybe the heat index there is different. Maybe the elevation is different. Maybe you're closer to the sun. You know, it's just, you know, you're higher up. So you get closer to the rays of, you know, what comes down from the sun. You know, there could be a lot of things. So I'm not even worried about that. But I knew some people were a little bit disappointed with that. But anyway, here's this top right here, which totally looks like a Rico Suave type top. <laughs> Which is so funny because if he has like bulging, bulging muscles, like you got him like deck decked, man, it's kind of, it's kind of, oh, okay, okay, I, I'm digging it, I'm digging it. Okay, then we got this one right here, which is like a little torn top, all right, yeah, okay, I mean, it looks like a shipwreck top, like he was in a, yeah, like he was in a shipwreck. That's what that looks like. All right. And then we got this one here. Okay. We showing all sorts of skin with the clothing. All right. Which would have been really cool, which, you know, I'm going to talk about CC whenever I do this type of stuff. This top right here and put an accessory um, t-shirt underneath it. I'm digging it because this jacket is really cool. But I don't know if I'd always want the option to have it open. I might want to put a shirt underneath it, you know, but I do like the shirtless option. But I would have rather to have both a shirt option and a shirtless. And of course, they didn't give us those. OK, they never give us enough options, enough uh, variety and alternatives. They I just feel like they, they missed the boat with some of that sometimes. But that's OK. That's where CC fills in the blanks. We have figured this out a long time ago. So then we got this shirt here, uh, then this one. These are really nice swatch colors. And so far, I mean, you know, some of these I probably won't, I'm gonna be honest with you guys, some of these I probably won't ever use, but some of these I probably, like this one here, I probably use this one, but again, this one is nice, but I would like to have the option to have a shirt underneath it as well. Um, okay, then we have this one. Yeah, it's all about the skin. It's all about showing your pectorals and your chest hair and <laughs> all of the above. I'm digging it, I'm digging it. Okay, all right. And then we got this one here, okay. Looks kind of tribal too. I like this one. It's kind of funny, though, because it's like if it's supposed to be so hot all the time, this looks like a really thick Afghan sweater. Does it not? It looks like it would just burn you from the insides. But all right, then we got this white shirt, which is nice, I think. OK, there's a little detail around the neck. I'm like, OK, we already have a lot of white shirts, but this is a different white shirt. I do like this one. Um, the funny thing is I'm <laughs> the whole time I'm clicking. I'm just like, man, the recolor options here. They gave us a white. So you guys could that make CC. Could go crazy because I could see like a ton of options to recolor this. Um, especially if you're into like making name brand stuff, this would be totally a good base for like making like a polo or like just a polo t shirt pulled over, you know. Or who else is out there that we like? I don't know, I, I can't think of anybody else right now. Anyway, <laughs> let's go over to this one. Okay, so interestingly enough, this looks like okay, no, it's not. I was about to say, this looks like these two shirts mixed together. But this actually is short sleeve and not sleeveless. So they gave us this with the short uh, sleeve over like a little layered sleeved look. And then we have this one, which I think was uh, for the mermaids or mermans rather, or the mer people. But it also can work pretty good for um, just walking around the island, I guess. Is this supposed to be like seaweed wrapped and netting? Maybe perhaps? Man, he is buff. Goodness gracious. Okay. Um, all right. So let's do the full body real quick. So we got uh, just a scuba suit, looks like. Alrighty. And then we have for bottoms. Let's put him on just a regular. Like, what would be my favorite top out of all of this? I don't even know. Let's just put the white shirt on because I don't know what type of bottoms we're going to be dealing with. All right. So then we got these shorts right here, which are really nice. They're a nice length. Thank you very much because I cannot stand short, short shorts on my guys. Um, so these are nice. I like a little pocket cargo thing going on. Then we have the longer ones, which are nice as well. I would have liked some prints on these as well, but I do appreciate the solid options. Then we got these here, the little drop crotch type pants or capris or crop pants, drop top crop, drop top crop pants, drop top crop pants, 
drop top crop pants. I'm sorry, I got in the zone for a second. I'm like, that sound like that could have been like a little beat. <laughs> I got the drop top crop pants. A hey, drop top crop pants. <laughs> I don't even know if that's what they're called. Drop crotch top, whatever. Um, <laughs> I said it totally wrong. I was supposed to say drop crotch crop pants. I said drop top crop. I don't know what I said. Anyway, then we got the shorty shorts, the ones that I said I didn't like, but they could always go swimming in these or go to bed in these. I don't know. I'm not a big fan of shorty shorts, uh, and especially not for the guys. That's just me personally, though. But anyway, then we got this little sarong wrap for the guys. Then we have, um, hmm, so it's like a skirt. Skort. I'm gonna take his tattoos off just so we can pay attention to it a little bit. It's like a skirt short option, like a squirt, <laughs> I think. Then we got a, a feather skirt, wrap skirts. This is a squirt as well, maybe, perhaps. I do like the prints, y'all. Ooh, I like these a lot. Drawstrings at the bottom, details pocket. All right, let's see. Now, see these, I probably would have, okay, good. I'm about to say, I would have rather a couple of solid prints on these two, but I do appreciate they gave us options. Thank you. Uh, then we have some torn jeans for that castaway look. No, no, I'm just joking. Some people like torn jean shorts. Some people do. Uh, then we got a longer, um, I was about to call it a sarong, but I don't think it is because it doesn't tie, but it's like a little skirt doohickey majiga. Then we got another one. Oh, y'all, these look more like for like the tribal, maybe some of the cultural type stuff of the island. And then, of course, we got this one, which is essentially, oh, no, it's a little different. Okay. Okay. It seems like a lot of these are the combination of the same thing over and over, but definitely some pieces that are strategically for the island, the culture of the island. So I appreciate that because you can have like a whole culture, whole story, whole historical type, you know, situation going on on the island. And I, I appreciate that. Did we get new category? Okay. Swimsuits and swimwear. Hmm. Interesting. Alrighty. So let's go over to the accessories. We got a, a bracelet over here or a little leafy bracelet and a bracelet over there. All right, so that's what we got for the guys. And for shoes, we got some, um, I was about to say gladiators. Those are not gladiators, but we got some sandals, uh, which are really cool. And then we got some flippers, which are equally as cool. Okay, very nice. All right, so far, so good. Um, there's, like I said, there's a lot of pieces that are specific for the island. So you might only use them for the specific indigenous people of the island. And uh, that's nice. But if you also have a couple of universal pieces, so yeah, but there's a handful that I'm kind of wishing that we had more to go with it, but I do appreciate them. So I'm, I don't know, I'm kind of on the fence so far with the guy stuff. There's not anything that I'm just kind of like, wow, that was awesome. Um, but there's definitely some pieces that I think, yeah, they, they look good. Like I like these shorts. I like the, yeah, I do. I do like some of the stuff for sure. Um, before we skedaddle out of here, let's go take a look at the style looks because sometimes I can give you an idea of what they were thinking when they put some of these pieces together. So this one right here actually looks pretty nice, especially with this dude got the <laughs> the belly and he had the washboard abs. It looks better on my guy. But anyway, it comes in these different colors. Very nice. See, that's nice. Um, and then for this one, we got the weekend, weekend look. Ooh. Okay, okay, okay. The zaddy over here on the island. He's like the island zaddy. <laughs> All right, so we got that one. Very nice. And then we got, oh, that's it. So we just got two looks for the gentleman. I'm surprised we didn't get more. Oh, okay, well, then we got some formals. Okay, well, let's take a look at these real quick. So these are considered the lava, lava, lava vestment. All right, and then we, okay, that's all we got for that. Then for here, no athletic stuff, no night stuff. We do have a couple party things, but this is probably, wow. Okay, see, I see what they're trying to do. Cause I was like, what are you gonna wear with this? Nothing, you're gonna wear no shirt and you're just gonna have that on. Lovely, I'm digging it, I'm digging it. All right, and then for Riptide, we got for bathing suit stuff or for swimwear rather. And then we got, oh, Scuba Steve. That is funny. Scuba Steve is from that Adam Sandler movie. <laughs> Wait, did I not look at the swatches? Maybe I didn't. That's funny. I don't think I looked at the swatches for this. I think I was just like, oh, it's a scuba suit. And then I just kept moving. That's cool. I actually like this, <laughs> this skeleton one. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie. I like that skeleton one. All right, that's all we got. Oh, Peru flare. No, okay, so the skirts, y'all, are for no shirts. I'm digging it. It's kind. It's kind of hot. 
I give them that. It is kind of hot. All right. And then that's it. Okay. So that would make a lot of sense because I was trying to figure out in my brain how to pair some of this stuff. So it's literally with nothing. You pair it with absolutely nothing. All right. So we got Riptide again, which we seen. No, have we not? The funny thing is, I don't think these shorts came with... Uh, I think these shorts are from another pack or maybe from like base game. Uh, then we got Beach Lifter, which we just saw that one on the everyday. Then we got this one and this one. These are the... Okay. And then for cold... They're not going to ever get cold there. I wonder what the weather is going to be like for seasons there. Makes you wonder. All right, let's switch over real quick to the merman. <laughs> this man's body. Oh, my gosh. Dude, I don't know what's going on with you. All right, so he has these. Let me go to his merman merman look real quick. All right, there we go. Um, so he does have shirts here. We got this. All right, so he does have some shirt options and accessories. He has these. And then, of course, his fin, which we already looked at that. But, of course, he does not have the pants and the full body, which makes sense. All righty. So let's check out the ladies real quick. Oh, gosh. I swear, whenever they randomize Sims for me, I'm just like, what were you thinking? All right, let's go over. I think the teeth will probably be the same situation. Yeah, we got these weird jagged teeth, which I'm not sure who's going to have those teeth. And then for hair, wow. We got tons of options for the lady hair. So, of course, we got this hairstyle, which, again, I wish we got without... Or at least this is an accessory or an option with the hair with or without. Unless this is a hairstyle we already have. I feel like it's not. I feel like I would remember a hairstyle like this. But then we have a... Ooh. Wait a minute. Let's make it lighter so we can see the details. Okay, girl. Your eyebrows right now. But I'm going to let them go. But this is cute. So there's like a braid at the top. There's two braids on the side. Oh, nope. There's a braid on one side. Um... Okay, the asymmetricness in me, like the the need to be asymmetric all the time, this is gonna kill me. <laughs> I think it would look a lot better had it had the braids on both sides. Um, okay. Um, yeah, I think it was. <laughs> Goodness, Samantha, you were so picky. I'm sorry. It just looks a little off. Like why would like if I was to do this hairstyle in real, in real life, I would literally. Part it here, part it over here, and then braid the top, braid the sides, and put it in one big pony. That's what I would do. Um, okay. It's a cute hairstyle, don't get me wrong, but I was really excited when I saw it over here, thinking it was going to be the same way over here, and it's not. So that's a little bit odd to me. But anyway, then we got this hairstyle, which is the same one we got for the guys. This one, which everybody has seen, because this is from the trailer. This is from the, um, the, the cover pack, the picture of the cover. And everything so the only thing that bothers me about this one this is gonna be me being picky again is in real life if your hair is curly down here it's not gonna be smooth up here unless you didn't sat there and gel that thing down like crazy which if you have gelled it down like crazy you're not gonna go in the water I promise you you're not gonna touch the water you're gonna sit on the sidelines on the beach in the on the in the recliner chair and chill because as soon as you hit the water and this thing is gelled down because it's trying to be smooth it's gonna to revert to this curl stuff right here and I'm speaking from personal experience because I have curly hair so saying all that to say <laughs> the only thing that bothered me and the first thing I thought when I saw the trailer and I saw the game the pack picture is how in the world did she pull this off I'm just curious unless she took a curling iron and a curling wand to the bottom but it's almost like I would have rather have like a little wavy texture up here to kind of like go with the waves at the bottom it just doesn't seem very realistic like I swear if you put like something over I don't know it just seems like two different hairstyles that they mash together and they really don't have like a consistency to them but that's just me being overly picky um so then we got this one right here which ooh, a little side loose oh I like this one a little side loose braid pony situation then we have this one oh guys and see this one has like a little bit of the texture i don't know if you guys can kind of see it it's not like straight it's got like a little wave to it like you could tell she kind of brushed it back and then stuck it up in this little uh pony let's make it a different okay so we can see the texture very nice i like it okay then we got this one here which is really nice Ooh, i like that too like a swoop 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 lovely okay very nice okay then we got this one Oh, see, this looks better on the shoulder than what they gave us for the. Well, there's a little bit of a lift, but it's not as bad as it was with the guy. But see, I could fill it in. So it's not as bad as it was with the guys. 
That is a nice one. Very pretty. Okay. Uh, then we got this one, of course, because we always get the same hairs for the ladies and for the guys. Then we got this up one. Then we got this one. Uh, okay. Okay. No, it still has that gap right there too. I was like, why is it working better for the guy, the ladies than this for the guys? All right. Then we got this same hairstyle, but we got different colors, which is really pretty. And then we have this one, ooh, which has different colors too. Oh. <gasps> Okay, this is what I'm talking about when they give us options, because you basically gave us the same hairstyle, but if I wanted just regular colored versus this, or this versus that, then you have options. That's really nice. I'm almost up to say if they would have gave us this in the color option, that would have been pretty too. That would have been really nice too. All right, so there's the hair. Uh, for hats, let's see what we got. Actually, let's put on a hairstyle that's gonna be easy to, to pair some stuff with. All right, so then for hats, we got this one, and we got this one. Okay, so no floppy beachy hats okay but truth be told i think oh i did the wrong thing i think we have beachy um hats already uh fashion choice feminine okay i think we have kind of beachy floppy hats already so maybe they felt like we didn't need to get any more eesh okay and then this one and i don't have any cc in my game right now i'll probably have more once i have cc in my game so i guess because we got the beachy floppy hats for um in the base game maybe they felt like they didn't have to give us any more i don't know i think about island i'm just thinking about so many different hair pieces and stuff like like you can go crazy all right accessories we got these beautiful uh fan earrings which are really pretty all righty and then we got these goggles this this okay so this i'm just going through stuff so we can see everything we're not gonna be able to see this necklace because of what she has on so let's change to another shirt real quick just for, ooh, I like that top. All right. Um, so then we got, and they all match pretty much blue. Yes, nice. I like when they give us matching sets because sometimes you'll get like the perfect earring, but you can't find the necklace to go with it because it looks so off. So that's really cool. Okay, then of course we got the whistle. Then we have this beautiful shell necklace or whatever this is, opal. What is this? This is gorgeous. Oh my gosh, it's beautiful. And then we have this one. Oh y'all, these are beautiful very nice okay so those are the necklaces we got well accessories we got and for makeup we got the same thing for uh, which is so funny because i'm almost like i wouldn't even use this for mermaids like if we were doing like a uh a, i don't what do they do like if like a bond not a bonfire but they were doing something on the beach like for a celebration of something i would totally just throw this on my sim and let her go celebrate with the islands you know with the folk you know what i'm saying like i don't know so i don't i'm assuming that's for the mermaids because that's how i saw it being used but i would totally use it for other stuff as well so there is all of that very nice okay so let's go on and go into shirts so we got this top right here <gasps> y'all i could already tell you the ladies always get the good stuff though we already know this but this top right here yes 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 and more yes then we got this top which i just had her on which is very pretty Ooh, actually look at this hold on hold on hold on where'd it go yeah with the sheer it's almost like it's a cover-up but it's not that's really cute okay then we got this one here oh y'all i love oh i love the prints i love the prints especially the birds oh that's pretty that's pretty okay then we got this one here Ooh. oh oh y'all oh they did good with the girl oh, with the ladies so far oh they did good with the oh look at the back look at the back detail Oh my gosh, yes, 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 yes. Okay, uh, this one, okay, this is like a little cover up, this bathing suit underneath it, love it. Then we got this one. Oh, she's jogging on the beach, y'all. She's jogging on the beach, I love it. This is cute with the little tie thing in the front. Okay, then we got this one. Oh, I like this one too. I can see outfits already in my brain. This is crazy. All right, then we got this one. Very nice as well. Then we got this one. Oh, a little tie shoulder action. Love it. Okay, then we got this one. Y'all. Oh, they outdid themselves with the ladies. Yes, on the ladies. Okay. It's always easy to get stuff for the... I mean, that's how my CC folder looks right now. It's more stuff for the ladies than anything. Oh, y'all, look at these. They actually have like a texture. Like it looks like it's been like hand knitted or hand crocheted or whatever. Oh, that's pretty. And the lace details i would wear i would get a bathing suit like that in real life anyway then we got this option which is really nice different colors here very nice then we got this one which is oh speak 
<laughs> oh, this looks like an academy shirt. Like she's going to school. Oh, that's funny because this color reminds me of like a calico cat. Oh, it has numbers on the back. Okay, just the number four. I like, oh, I was about to say the number four because I like that. They, I was about to say I like that they use the number four because that's my favorite number. But they look like they used a couple of numbers. Okay. Is there going to be like a new sports for the island? Like a like a volleyball or something like that? That'd be cool. All right, then we got this top, which, ooh, I love this top. Yay, yay, yay. Love it, love it, love it. All right, then we got this one, which is another bikini top. I wish they would have gave us more island type hats, y'all. Because truth be told, I could sit there and say, oh, they didn't give us any because we already have some. But we already had bathing suits too. You know what I'm saying? And you gave you given us tons more. Anyway, we got coconut, um, a coconut bralet, I guess you can call it. And then we have a seashell one. Oh, wait, that looks super painful. But nonetheless, it's really pretty. Uh, but these will probably be used for the mermaids, I'm assuming, because the base has like the little mermaid tail. All right, so for full body, we got uh, these overalls, which are really cute. Comes in different colors. Then we got this, which is, ooh, this little wrap skirt thingy. It's like a wrap dress, but a tie back. Ooh, I like, I'd wear this in real life as well. I like when I can see clothing in The Sims that I'm like, I would totally wear because that looks so realistic and it's cute. Can't wait to put my Sims in this, but this is cute as well. Then we got this one, cute. Y'all, oh my gosh, I love these. These are look really good. Oh, I like this too. Oh, y'all, oh, look at the back. I'm sorry. I'm just like in love right now. That is a really nice one piece. It's funny because, um, you know what? I'm about to say, hold on a second. Let me get a solid color. I like how they put the little wrinkles on the side of the lines. Like I love when they do details like this because it looks so realistic. Like she's stretched into it. Like it's a bathing suit. Don't make it look like it's just painted on her. Make it look like she's actually wearing it. I like details like that, of course. And then here is the scuba suits, which we could check out all the swatches since I didn't do that last time. Same ones the guys got. All right, so let's give her a shirt just for the sake of it. And let's go check out the bottoms again. The ladies got outdid. Um, so we got these pants with like a little sarong thingy that goes with it. All right, then we got just the sarong by itself. Should totally go with a nice bikini top. Then we got a shorter version of like a little skirt. The color is absolutely stunning. Different colors there. Then we got the shorts. That's really pretty. All right, I'm forgetting to check out the uh, swatches, y'all. Okay, then we got this one, a little wrap skirt with a little um, metal, be metal, <laughs> metal belt detail. Girl, could you talk today? All right, and then we got this longer skirt. This is really cute. Uh, then we got these little shorts. Cute, too, with a little pocket detail with a zipper in the back. Cute. And we got this skirt, which is like kind of like what the guys got. Looks very similar to the guys one. Then we got a, ooh, the bikini bottom that goes with, this one, ooh, cute. I like that. And then we got, oh, and then of course it comes in the colors, the same colors probably. Very nice. And then we got this bottom. I wonder if they have pieces that match everything. Then of course we got this, I guess it's like a grass skirt maybe. Kind of, it kind of looks like a grass skirt, honestly. It kind of does. I'm gonna say clicked off of it. And then we got this one here, just like a little sarong around the bikini bottom. Alrighty, so let's go check out the accessories here. We just got the two um, same things we got for the gentleman and for the shoes, we got a couple different options, like a little toe slide, like not, not toe, <laughs> a bow slide. Oh, so we have that. Oh my gosh. And then we got the same shoes that we have for the guys. We got like a little wedge heel type shoe. It's really pretty, different colors. Those are cute. Oh, those are really cute. And then of course we got the flippers or what do you call these things? I said it earlier, I probably said it right earlier and just completely forgot. I forgot to check and see, did we get any tattoos? I'm sure we got tattoos for the ladies, but what do they look like? Okay, so we got the arm one here. Ooh, that's really nice. It has like a lobster crab. Wait, is that what that is? Or, okay, I was thinking that was like a lobster and a crab, but maybe not. Uh, and then we got, where was that one at? Um, then we got this one. Okay, that's really nice. Then we got a leg one. Ooh. That's really pretty. You know, I don't, I don't remember seeing the details of it on the guys. And of course we got this one. So the same ones we got for the guys. I don't see, oh, we got this back one, of course. So that's really pretty as well. Um, and it probably is the same. I don't think that we got any new 
walk styles. I'm sure we didn't. All right. So I think that's pretty much it for the lady. Oh, you know what? Before we continue, let's take a look at the um, styled look. So we got the festival lookbook. Comes in different colors. Very cute. All right. Then we got the opulent tourist. Oh, see, they got the hat from the... Oh, she put fishnets on with it. I don't know that I would have put fishnets on <laughs> It's an opulent tourist though. So of course she would up the ante just a little bit. And then we got the Solani styling. Oh, cute. Oh, I like this one, y'all. It looks like a native of the islands. And I think that's it. So let's see if we got any formals. We got, of course, the island gala. Very pretty. I like to see how they, they styled them up though, because you could kind of see what they had in mind. Um, okay, so then we got the cool summer. That's pajamas. Wait, how did I miss this whole dress? How did I miss? Did I not do full body? Wait, hold on, y'all. Did I not? Did I see this and I just completely overlooked it? I don't remember seeing this. That's really, if I seen it already, I forgive me. That was totally, I don't remember seeing that unless I was too busy talking about other stuff. Okay, this one is really pretty. So they're considering this like a sleep because I would have totally wore this out and about. <laughs> that seems like a waste for that to be asleep. All right. And then we got party. We got this one here. Oh, that's cool. Different colors. All right. And then we got, ooh, this one, the same one for the formal. And then that's it for that. And then for bathing suits, of course, I'm sure. Okay. So they're, they're considering this a swimwear as well. All right. And then, ooh, beach boho. Girl, this pose though. Can we get this pose in real life? Like, that's cute. She's giving it. Oh, and I got the glasses to go. That's another thing we didn't get any new glasses. No new sunglasses. But again, they probably thought y'all got enough sunglasses. Ooh, girl, get it. Makeup and everything on points. Okay, she gonna have to stay in my gallery because she's cute. She is really cute. Okay, girl, and the way you posing and stuff. Yeah, you're going, you're going straight to the gallery. All right, so then we got this one, which is interesting because these bottoms we already had. In, in the base game but then this top is new so they kind of mixed it up with some stuff we already had but you know it's funny why wouldn't we have gotten a bottom to go with this anyway you know to have to go to another pack and get a bottom it seems kind of like this one makes sense because it's red and red and it just has like a little top this one makes sense because it's orange with the green and it's got orange and the green here but well i guess all of yeah but this with the yeah i don't know it's, it's a little bit different but anyway so we got those and then we got scuba sally <laughs> all right all right scuba sally uh and then here we got the festival lookbook again the opulent tours again the high impact waves all right let's check this one out oh look at the little short like you know what y'all i think i was behind here looking at the pocket detail completely missed the flowers over here oh they're all different okay all different swatches cute though i like that all right and then we got S -S salani style we did that one already and that's it. And then for cold, we probably have nothing because it doesn't probably get cold there. Very cute. Okay, so, so far I'm really liking the girl stuff. I think the only thing that's, honestly, no, there was not one thing that I didn't like for the girl stuff. Um, so let's go check out the, um, we wanna make her a female. All right, so you could totally have her shirtless and just cover her with some fancy scales there did we get new we didn't get new hairstyles for okay we got the same hairstyles but this hairstyle is from where is that from what's this hairstyle from is that from get famous i think that's from get famous interesting okay that that's interesting okay i'm like why would they <laughs> i don't know i'm thrown off right now all right so we got hats accessories i'm just trying to figure out what we can do for the mermaid so we got these tops and of course these two right here and then for the body how did they get this but is it a oh oh so we did get different skin tones but they're just for the mer people okay we got a couple different ones but they're just for the mer people i completely messed that up i apologize and then we got so I'm trying to figure out where do they get the scales thingies that she has. Oh, here they go. Okay, that's what I was looking for earlier. Okay, so these are the different scale thingies that you can get for them to kind of cover that up. If you don't, if you don't put it on, then they have a bra, so you might want to put this on, or you could put this. Okay, that's really cool. All right, so do they? I'm curious. Do they match? Like, let's say I put the green on when I go to the tail. Is there a green? Okay, so it does match. Okay, 
Okay, that's that's pretty cool. All right, I hadn't had a chance to see any of the mermaid stuff, so I was just curious if it matched up with um, stuff that we had. Okay, it does. Oh, that's really cool. That is really cool. And then the fa oh. Oh. Ooh. Why, why would this be an option? Wait, is her teeth like that? Okay, and then, then you give her the teeth like this? And then she's a really scary mermaid? Is, is that what we're doing? I, I'm confused. Are these mermaid faces? Oh my gosh. Did we get new eyes? <gasps> we got new eyes. Are these new eyes for the mermen? For the merpeople? Oh my gosh. So traditionally are mermaids considered like, I mean this face right here, the little doll face. But I, why am I afraid of her all of a sudden? Like I was excited to see her a couple minutes ago, but now I'm afraid of her. Yeah, I'm totally fearful of my of my life right now. Like I don't think I'm gonna go to the island and, and deal with the mermaids if they look like these. Um, um, hmm. Is this is this like? Um, I'm confused. Is this like okay? Face okay. Are these mer are these mer people face? Can someone please tell me in the comments? Am, am I? Oh my gosh. Okay. These look like the ugly to beauty challenge sims that you see in the gallery. Some of these do. Some of these look like that. Like seriously, like did we do this on purpose? I mean, even with the ears sticking out, I'm, I'm confused. I'm so confused right now. Are they evil mermaids? Okay, okay, let's see real quick, y'all. Let, let's see, let's see. Are, are there evil mermaids? Is there is there like an evil thingy? Do, do you want to be evil in life? I'm confused. Is there any new traits to be in like an evil mermaid? No? Okay. Um. I Can I see what, what's going on? Is there... Okay. So now... now mm, <laughs> I'm a little speechless. When we saw these teeth earlier, I was trying to figure out who was wearing these teeth. So I'm assuming it's the mer people. So is there a reason why they would have... Why they would be like this? I swear they look like, okay, now it's not, wait, how did I get this before? How did I get these faces before? Oh, do I have to be, I have to be in her, I have to be in her mermaid form and then I can see those faces? Oh, wow. Okay. Okay. All right. Um, I mean, you know, to each its own, I guess let's go check out the guy merman real quick and see if the faces are different for the guy merman okay oh okay okay no there's some scary looking ones all right i'm gonna say oh they gave the merman like gorgeous faces but no they they have some scary looking ones as well okay they actually gave him this hairstyle even though this was supposed to be for the ladies which is fine that he got it but i'm just curious why it wasn't considered a a, a guy oh and then he's the merman too okay interesting Okay. I'm I'm so confused right now. Cuz some of these are like being mermen, but like like this right here, like I I guess I always when I whenever you think about mer people, you would always think that they're like super I don't know, like something. I I don't I don't I guess I'm trying to figure out what the mentality is behind some of this. But, you know, okay. All right. Um, all right, before we get too sidetracked, let's go on and look at some of the children clothing because I've gotten totally sidetracked. All right, so let's see. Is there any new hair? Okay, the same hair. Um, the same thing, pretty much. Did we get anything? Did we get the teeth too for them? So you can have mer children? Nope. Okay. Um, can children be mermen too? I don't even know. Can children be Invalid age group, delete mermaid form. Children do not have the mermaid form or mermaid power. Selecting this age option will delete your current mer You cannot undo this change. All right, so they can only be, can they be teens? Okay, so they can be teens and they could be adults, of course. And they could be elders. Of course, they could be all that, but they just can't be children. Okay, that's good to know because I didn't know if that was an option or not. All right, so let's go see. We got full body. We got shirts right here. We got these swatches right here. And then we got, of course, this shirts with the long sleeve layered look. 
cool. Then for full body, we got a whole swimsuit type thing. I guess that's like a swimming suit. <laughs> and then we have this one. Okay. This is considered a masculine suit, which is kind of unusual, but maybe. I don't know if that's something that's like, so, I don't know. When I see these traditionally, I think of they belong to the girls, but maybe for the boys too. I don't know. Okay. And then for the pants, we got these. Oh, these are cool. And then we got this. So they're pretty much the same stuff that we got for the adults. Couple of variations, but for the most part, same things. Accessories, nothing. And for shoes, we got some sandals, different colors. And then we got the flippers, of course. All right. And then let's change him to a girl. See if there's anything different. Alrighty. Any new hairs? Okay, we got these. This hairstyle and that hairstyle. Just a recreated. Uh, so nothing sp super specific that's different. Okay, we got this top, which is cute. That's a cute top. Then we got this one, and we got that one for the boys. So here we got another one for the girls here. It's kind of cute. And then we got this one. The little details down here is cute. Crochet top with the little details. They're kind of flat though. I wish that they had like a little bit of raised to them. Dang it. Okay. Then of course we got this. We got this dress, which is ooh, really pretty. Oh, that's cute. This dress is cute, y'all. Then we got this one. Oh, that's cute too. It's almost like she has a shirt and they tied on like a little sarong thingy at the bottom. That's really cute. Okay, then we got the all-in-one, and then we got this one. Those boots she got on right now is killing me. All right, and then for bottoms, we got these, of course, same thing. And then we got these shorts, which are a little bit different than what we've seen on the others. And then we got the grass skirts. Accessories, oh, we actually have leggings, which we can't see right now, so let's go put on the shorts. We got some leggings. They come in different colors, all right. And then, of course, for shoes, we got these little, oh, they got like a little flower embellishment. That's kind of cute. Then we got these shoes. And then of course the flippers. Cute. The kids getting any new aspirations? No, nope, nope. Do they get the water? Okay, so they do get the child of the island and the child of the ocean. So you could do that one. Oh, that's cute. Okay, did they get anything else? Let's double check real quick. I think that's it for the kids. Um, all right, let's go see if they got anything for the toddlers. Every once in a while, we get lucky with toddler stuff. So no hairstyles, no hats, no accessories. Okay. Um, we did get a new swim shirt. Probably comes with a bottom. Cute. Oh, that's cute. The little sea, uh, sh the little star sh fish. I was about to say star shell. Y'all, I'm tripping today. All right, and then we got the little skirt thingy here. Yeah. That's the only top we got though. So I guess you could toggle through the colors here. Kind of see some of the swatches. And then for full body, we got this little all-in-one, which is really cute. Then we got a little, aw, little bikini, little ruffly bikini with polka dots and some solid colors. Then we got, oh, y'all, this little dress is cute. Oh, that's adorable. All right, and then for bottoms, we already saw, oh, we got the grass skirt, of course. Then we got this one. And then for accessories, oh, we got, oh, we got little arm floaties. Oh, that's adorable. Oh, little man, that's cute. Where you going? You going swimming? Are you going swimming? All right, so that's all we got pretty much for um, the toddlers. We didn't even get any shoes. Let's take those off. And oh, we we'll put the floaties back on. Uh, did we get anything different for, is that the boy? Oh, that was a girl. <laughs> The hairstyle threw me off. Okay, let's uh, see if there's anything else we got for the... There's anything different? Okay, nope. Nope. All right, and then no hairstyles. All right, and the only thing I didn't check, which I just realized, I didn't see if there was any styled looks for... Pro okay, we do have Island Prince. Cute. Um, and Island Prince again. Okay. Owner of the Tide. Oh, that's cute. All right, he got a little glass, and then we got soaking up there. Okay, that's that. See if there's anything for the ladies real quick, for the little ladies. Far style, looks go. Island princess, oh, that's cute. Those are cute, y'all. That little dress is cute. Oh, and then this one with the little floaties and the little hat. That is adorable, y'all. Oh, they did good with that one. That's really cute. And then let's real quick, I forgot to check the kids, uh, the child. Okay, there we go. See if they have any style looks real quick. So he has all about that beach life. Is there anything else? Okay, 
And then we got Scuba Kid. All right. Oh, sorry. Got off of it. And then we got a uh, colorful sarong. All righty. That's cool. And then for bedtime, for athletic. Okay. And then we got colorful sarong again. Is there another one? Okay. No. And then nothing for every day. And let's switch over to the ladies real quick. The little ladies. See if they got any style looks for them. Literal, literal play. <laughs> That's cute. I like how they name these. Some of them are really cute. Um, and that's it for that. Then we got Jovial Sarong. Okay, different colors. All right. And then we got, what else? Okay, and then for party, we got Jovial Sarong. And that's it. Wait, Chic Rich. I didn't remember seeing that one before. That's a new dress. Okay, that's for uh, Get Famous, but that's new. I haven't seen that one yet. All right, and then we got Freestyle. Cute. And then we got Scuba's Kid. Of course, all the different colors. I clicked off of it by mistake. And then Captain of Cool. Okay. But I didn't even see the different colors for that one. Cute. And then for Hot, we got Literal, of course. And that's it. So very cool. So let me see real quick if we got anything for the pets. Because I do know that there's supposed to be new pet interactions at the beach. I doubt that we got anything for the pets, though. But let's just double check. They normally don't give us... Oops, clothes. They normally don't give us... Uh, pack specific clothing for the uh they don't normally give us stuff like that but i wanted to see anyway just in case because i know that they were supposed to give us um this is a cute dog oh my goodness you are adorable it's a mixed breed what is two different color eyes that is cute can i make you a puppy oh my goodness you are adorable Anyway, that's wholly beside the point. So that's pretty much for the cast items. I do like the lady stuff quite a bit. Uh, the mermaid stuff kind of scares me a bit. I always just thought mermaids were just like, you know, beautiful, kind of mysterious, but nothing like evil looking. Like this is kind of scary. Um, so I'm not sure what their thought process is behind that was, unless you got some evil mermaids taking over the islands. Is that going to be some of the storyline? I'm not even sure. But anyway, so that is it for the cast items uh so you can stay tuned for the build by mode items we'll get into the game and check those out so hopefully you guys enjoyed if you haven't already don't forget to subscribe thumbs up the video and i'll see you guys in the next one Bye.